guys, we're back for another Dokkan battle video, and today we're going to take a look at one of the best units in Dokkan history, Namek LR Super Saiyan Goku, full level 10 links. This guy is a behemoth. I'm going to try a slightly different method for doing these level 10 link videos. Now, I'm going to start with this Goku. Uh, let me know if you guys like this style, but uh, we are actually going to look at Goku on every single one of his teams uh, in this video. <laughs> So uh, we'll we'll try and get a bunch of different setups and stuff like that. Um, the thing about Namek Goku and Full Power Freezer that you do want to keep in mind is that they do stack both attack and defense. So, you know, we could go into an event and get to, like, turn 15. You know, they're shooting out, like, 10 million attack stats or you know, 500k plus defensive stats. Um, Namek Goku is really powerful. We're starting on the Planet Namek Saga team. I got kind of a shitty rotation. It is what it is. Um, yeah, I love... Goku started away from all the other units that would work well with him. Um, Goku is going to be a very powerful unit, for the most part, on most teams you're going to run, um, because of his very strong Saiyan link set. Now, with, like, Full Power Frieza, all we have is Fierce Spot on Legendary Power, but his other links from the top, Super Saiyan, Saiyan Warrior Race, Golden Warrior, Kamehameha, uh, Prepare for Battle, Fierce Battle, Legendary Power... He has a very good link set, right? He, he's going to look good. This Goku is going to look good. He's going to do a lot of damage. He's going to have good defensive stats a lot of times. Um, I think early in fights... Oh, are you kidding me? He, that's the five dodge, dude. <laughs> I love, yeah, we're getting the, the three and five dodges out of the way early in this video. Now, when Goku gets hit, keep in mind he does... I mean, he one-shotted cooler anyway. But when Goku gets hit before he attacks, he gets a guaranteed additional super. So the five dodge right there would have kept us from getting the guaranteed additional super. Um, I, I don't know if it's just me, but three and five dodge. I mean, the amount of super attacks I dodge with those are um, very silly, right? Okay, so uh, I want to try and like not go crazy on these metal coolers right here. Um, let's sort of see what happens. Um, you know, but I would like a lot of these metal coolers to survive for this next turn. Now, Namek Goku, right? He stacks defense on his 12-key super attack, and he stacks attack on his 18-key super attack. Comparing that to full power Frieza, I do like what Goku has better. Um, I think it's just much easier to get the 12-key super attacks consistently compared to the 18-key super attacks. We're taking a lot of damage there, Namek Goku. Hello, dude. This is a Dokkan event from three years ago, bruh. <laughs> God, Namek Goku. The, the old Namek Goku. Uh, has not aged very gracefully. We should not be taking this much damage in here, dude. What is this? You're making me look bad! I need that man to EZA so bad, dude. That STR Namek Goku. My boy. <laughs> we... <laughs> Please. You're embarrassing me. Alright, I don't think we're gonna die here. I mean, this Piccolo's not the greatest of all time either. Oh, he killed that. Okay, we're good. We're good. Because he killed that Metal Cooler. All right, we took a look. Hello? <laughs> look at... Damn it, Goku, you loser. What is this? I mean, to be fair, we got supered by, like, every single one of them. But still, very embarrassing. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay. All right, all right, all right. I, I think I'm going to use... <laughs> uh, I I'm a little embarrassed, but I'm going to use an item real fast. Don't mind me. <laughs> all right, so... Uh, this is going to be a strong rotation for Goku because, you know, we got Saiyan Warrior Race, Prepare for Battle, Fierce Battle, uh, and Legendary Power all activated. Look at Goku's defense shooting up to 225k after he stacked last turn. Um, Goku in slot 2 gets an extra 59% attack. He also gets 59% attack against an extreme class enemy. This is a very powerful rotation for Goku. Um, and he at this point, he has not stacked his attack, right? Remember, he stacks attack on his 18 p um, Goku and Frieza, by the way, both of them can quad super in slots two and three. Um, you could super attack five times, I believe, if we would get the active skill off, but I, that situation's, like, not possible. I think no enemy, I think, is strong enough to survive the active skill and then take five supers. So, eight mil right there, dude. This is, again, he had not stacked attack before this, and he drops an eight million attack stat, and again, he could super three more times. Yep, there's, there's number two, and we could still do two more. So this is where, like, Namek, Goku, and Full Power Frieza both can just go nuts. They could go ham Taro right here. Oh, oh I, I swore Goku was triple super in right there. Okay, that was a pretty good look at Goku. Um, that turn, he looked very impressive. 
right? And just, you know, with the 50% support kid Gohan, um, and then full power Freeze was giving him Fierce Battle and Legendary Power. So Goku definitely looks quite impressive there. Um, let's continue on. I think we'll probably go to the Pure Saiyan team next. All right, now we're over here on the Pure Saiyan team. Again, the thing about Goku that's going to be really good um, is his Link set. We have a lot of, uh, like, Saiyan characters that are going to be all over the place here that are going to be able to activate a lot of Goku's powerful links, right? Like, you know, the new Dokkan Fest Super Vegeta and Goku work tremendously well together, right? You know, you have just a lot of, like, really powerful characters, and, like, you know, links matter, and Goku is getting a lot of power from links, right? Things like Super Saiyan, Saiyan Warrior Race, Kamehameha, Fierce Battle, Legendary Power. It's a lot of attack. Um, so Goku, with a lot of these links active, is going to be doing good. This is, I mean, I guess it's... Goku, like, I would like him to be a bit better defensively. Just in my eyes, viewing what, like, the best unit in the game should be. I'm kind of, like, like grading him on that scale. Like, his defense turn one, it's not bad. Because it's 160, which is, like, solid. But he is going to probably, you know, as long as you get a 12p super attack, he's going to get a defensive stack. So, like, you know, after he gets a defensive stack, he's much closer to, like, 200k turn one, which is good, right? Um, but I, I, I think I would just like him to have a bit more personally, like, defensively turn one. I think that there's a very sizable gap um, between uh, Namek Goku and Full Power Freeze at turn one, which is why I like Full Power Freeze better than Namek Goku. But I do think... The deeper you go into events, personally, I think Namek Goku is more impressive. Um, I, I just think he's a little bit more balanced in terms of his um, defense. His defense is better than Frieza, the, the further you get into events. Um, okay, so again, this is Goku with Super Saiyan, Golden Warrior, Prepare for Battle, and Fierce Battle. 160k. I got him in slot 1 because you know we'll get the guaranteed double super attack. Um, this is no support, just with a bunch of links. Still a 4 million attack set right there. The thing about Full Power Frieza and Namek Goku is they have Mega Colossal on their 12 key super attacks. So the damage they do is just like crazy. It, 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 it's, 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 it's insane how hard um, these units hit on just 12 key super attacks, right? You know, you look at some of these other major powerful LRs. Sure, you know, they're 18 key super attacks. They could do crazy attack stats and stuff like that. But Namek Goku and Frieza, the numbers that you see them do even on their 12 key super attacks, I think are just like very, very incredible, right? And just makes them look ridiculously good. Okay, so here, let, let's run Goku in slot two, right? So remember, Goku does get an additional 59% attack and then a medium chance of launching an additional super, a second or third attack on its turn. But like that passive allows you to proc, like, like if you get the hidden potential system, basically you could proc that part of his passive twice. I don't think the attack buff gets proc twice, but the uh, chance to additional does, for sure. Um, I'm not going to be able to get the 18 key super attack right here, unfortunately. I mean, that can happen with Goku and Frieza. If you're not running a lot of supports or depending upon the situation, if you're specifically not fighting the opposite class, I do think key can be an issue. So right here, we're fighting a super class enemy, future Gohan. So Goku is not, like, both Goku and Freeze have this ability, one key at the start of each turn, up to a max of three, uh, and 59% attack. For Goku, it's against an extreme class enemy. For Freeze, it's against a super class enemy. We're not going to be able to activate that here. I think that does hold them back a little bit. Key can be an issue if we're not just flooding it with um, supports, right? That's definitely something to keep in mind. Um, this Kaioken Goku, by the way, with an EZA could be fairly impressive. Um, but he definitely does need easy A. Um, but I, I, I would like to see him get one again. With an easy A, I think that Kaioken Goku could be kind of solid. Um, Namek Goku up to 5.5 .5 right there. Wow, that's without an 18 key super attack too. So no attack stats. So it's like you, you can see how you kind of just like are throwing Namek Goku around. And like he's putting up crazy numbers, right? He's very versatile with his link set, with the units you're able to use him with. He's just good. This guy's good. Uh, he's just really goddamn good. That's it. All right, guys. Now we're over here on the full power team. Um, you know, you could build a pretty interesting sort of like Saiyan type of full power build here. Um, with a lot of characters that are going to link up very well with LR Goku. Obviously, AGL Gohan has all seven links you can activate with LR Goku. So that's very, very good. Um, I'm going to go ahead and... Let me see, that's going to change physical orbs. Yeah, so this can go ahead and get us, uh, like, I think, 24 key right here. 
which is what I would like to see. So now Goku is going to be able to go crazy. So this is turn one, no support. We do have him linked with LR Gohan, which is five out of seven. Only Saiyan Warrior Race and Golden Warrior are not activated right here. Um, so let's go ahead and see how much damage Goku will put up on this rotation. What is our defense? 130k. Um, but I believe Broly... For full power, he's giving 170 attack and then 130 HP and defense is what Broly is giving for his full power leader skill. So let's go ahead and see uh, what type of damage we're going to get from our boy Goku right here. Starting out at 6.54. No support, right? That's full 24 key. He did get attacked before he went. So that means he would have a guaranteed additional super coming in after that as well we would still have another attack that would be queued in um on this rudigarn right here so again you guys are seeing like it's just you're gonna see consistent high numbers uh pretty much the whole way through with this goku right like i it's outside of him being maybe a, a bit weaker defensively than i would like um turn one uh, like, he, Namek Goku is still just a ridiculous juggernaut. Just, like, very, very powerful. Um, able to hit very high attack numbers. Even with the additionals, the damage gets very, very sick, nasty high. Um, he's just able to do a lot. Um, all right, so I, I, we'll get one more turn out of him from full power. I think we'll go to the Goku family team. Um, and I'll let the event sort of go on for a while. Maybe we'll let Goku stack up quite a bit. You know, we could see some of his higher attack stats. We could see some higher defensive stats from him. Just sort of let him go crazy in a bit of a longer event, I'm thinking, um, after this turn. So now we have support on rotation. Um, Goku did stack last turn. Uh, I am going to... Uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and... I'm, I'm going to key him up up to 24 key again um just because i would like to see what numbers he's at you know max 24 key um again we do have a uh, golden cooler on rotation golden cooler of course is giving support as well so let's see the numbers that our boy goku is going to get with five out of seven links activated um you know this type of lr powerful goku you know makes like this in lr gohan a little bit better for example right 7.27 right there very good then there he is at a six million attack set on the 12 b Oh, we got we did get the hidden potential system additional, but no super attack right there. So it's just like, like he's relentless, right? I think in a lot of events, you probably do sort of want to start out with Goku, probably aiming for 12 key super attacks, aiming for them. You're going to be getting your defensive stacks in, which is probably more important than getting the offensive stacks in. But I mean, Goku has these turns where he double, triple supers, all of these 12 key supers getting all these defensive stacks. And Goku can get very tanky for long events. He's just very, very good overall. Um, I, the more I've used this Namek Goku, um, the more I have come to really like him. Actually, let me stick around right here because I think if we don't kill Harutagarn on this turn, I think we're going to be able to active skill him with Namek Goku next turn. Let me see. Um, but I, I'm, I mean, one attack from any of these three, and I think Harutagarn is done. But if not... Oh, yeah, I, I think he's done. Okay, okay, cool. Um, so, yeah, let's go to a Goku family team. Um, and let's go ahead and take a look at Goku, you know, sort of stacking up for quite a while over on a Goku family team. Eh, maybe not. If the other two miss, we're going to finish this with the active skill. Okay, Goku finished them up. Because um, remember, the active skill we could use against an extreme class enemy. Um, you know, when there's one extreme class enemy, 30% HP or less, you could pop the active skill. Um, which is, you know... I, very powerful finishing blow from this Namek Goku. All right, guys. So now we're on the Goku family team. Uh, over here, you know... Okay. Number one, people always cry, ah, You're using a 150 lead on oh, a showcase. Ah. Dude, the Goku family team is one of the top teams in the game. And you run this Goku as leader. No, you are not running LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku as lead. No, no, no. So we're rocking this Goku. Uh, we have very good links with him. Five out of seven. Uh, so let's go ahead and let our boy LR Super Saiyan Goku cook. Let him cook. All right. So he's going to be doing a lot of damage. Again, we got a lot of links active. You know, things are looking good. I don't think they have any special effects. They don't like seal or anything, do they? They better not. Um, alright, so just a little, that's not really that much damage right away. Uh, 5 million at the start. So, we're probably just gonna, I'm gonna chill in this stage for a little bit. Uh, again, Goku member is doing extra damage against extreme class enemies. 
We're going to get the active skill in this run. You know, Goku is stacking attack. We're stacking defense. I just want to sort of see, like, how powerful this Namek Goku is going to get. Like, sort of, like, by the time we get towards the end of this event, right? Like, how strong is he actually going to get? Like, what are the attacks that's going to look like? What are his defensive stats going to look like? Like, once we sort of get towards the end here. Um, we're going to rock the, the AGL LR Gohan next to him, of course. Get all seven links active. Uh, which will guarantee that his power is going to be very high uh, with all seven links active. I did also bring, like, B-Pan and stuff like that. So, you know, we could have our girl B-Pan, you know, sort of, you know, get that active skill buff at one point later on in the fight. We could sort of see Goku's damage, right? Because remember, B-Pan works really well with characters that just have, like, massive start-of-turn attack stats, which Goku, like... Goku gets 159% attack at the start of turn, right? And then if he's in slot 2, he's getting another 59% attack. Then if he's going against an extreme class enemy, he gets another 59% attack, right? So it's going to be very easy for him to do a lot of damage. That's the other thing too, right? In this event, um, Goku is going to be building up key, right? Because every single turn, um, you know, we're fighting extreme class enemies, his key is going to be rising. So that's going to be really good. All right, so again, 5 out of 7 still, 225k defense he's up to. This attack stat should be quite a bit better than what we've seen before. We have 50% support hit Gohan around as well. Uh, that's one good thing for Goku uh, is that Gohan is on a lot of his team. 6.55 right there. Um, not, I mean, honestly, like, like we're going to see much better attack stats from him, but it is very balanced considering he does that and then another super attack and now his defense this quickly closing in on 300k but i mean that was a pretty good turn like his attacks i was a little bit lower like comparative to speaking to like frieza right like in a similar situation where we have a character activating most of frieza's links and he has like a 50 percent support we probably would see frieza like eight or nine million right there um but again goku as the event is going on and on and on he is building up towards that point right that's that's sort of how it's going to work for goku i'm going to do this right here yep 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 uh, I I'll go ahead and push off Kid Gohan. We'll see, uh, you know, once we've got Kid Gohan around, um, how he is going to uh, sort of fare um, in giving uh, Goku um, a bunch of, uh, like, defense and stuff like that. That AGL Gohan, as much as I use him, people know how crazy I go for that AGL Kid Gohan. I just think he is absolutely outstanding, exquisite, spectacular, demonic, powerful, every single word you could think of. Um, that AGL Kid Gohan is a beast. He is so good to run in these teams. Um, the key, the defense, the amazing active skill. He just has a lot that he brings to the table. Um, all right, and we're continuing to move on. Again, Goku is just stacking up attacks, stacking up defense every single time. I might skip a few turns after this next turn, right? And, you know, again, we'll, we'll slowly move forward. We're building Goku up. So here Goku is, right? Uh, this is turn five, right? This is going to be nearly a 24 uh, key super attack. Goku is 232k defense. He's been stacking up offensively, defensively. We're just going to keep going and keep letting um, our boy Namek Goku stack up, right? Uh, and we'll try and get the active skill as well. Uh, to get the active skill, all we have to do is uh, get one of an extreme class enemy 30% HP or less. It is definitely my favorite animation in the game. I would easily easily say that right like <laughs> absolutely is that my favorite animation in the game so all right let's um let's go ahead and keep going here <laughs> uh, again i'm gonna skip ahead a couple of turns uh and we'll see what goku's looking like uh in a few turns all right so we're a few turns deeper here uh goku up to over 300k defense at this point which is definitely pretty good um, we have the 50% support. Of course, he's got all links activated with AGL Gohan. Uh, so that's going to be good for him. Um, I think I'm going to use the shoe item to get him the full 24 key. Uh, and let's go ahead and see what the damage numbers we're going to see out of this Goku in this turn look like. Um, again, this is where, like, I, I think Goku, a lot of times, um, especially if you're aiming for his 12 key, we could get his defense much higher than Frieza's. I've been going for 18 key super attacks, like, in this run, right? Because I'm trying to see like balance like i want like him to get the really high attack stats while also having the high defensive stats um i don't know in this run i'm not really seeing anything i would say oh god yeah that's where okay that's where shit starts getting ridiculous right he does that huge number but then the 12 he is so close in terms of damage what the fuck, 
That is so ridiculous. The di it's that's so crazy. Like I don't know how like like more clear I can make it how stupid that damage is right there. Oh my! Wait, Bobbity seals? No way. Tell me that we are about to go into this next turn and Bobbity is gonna seal Goku. There's no way. Nah, I, I, I think we're good, because I think we're going to probably... Oh, no, I, I think he stuns, too, doesn't he? Okay. Now, nah, we'll be good. Oh, no, maybe he doesn't stun. Okay, okay. If we don't finish off Bobbity, and we're not able to get the active skill next turn, uh, we'll be able to get a really massive attack stat by Goku. The only thing is, I do want to put him in slot 2 um, to get that extra attack buff, right? But it's like, for the most part, Freeze and Goku, you are actually going to want to place him in slot 1 to get the guaranteed additional super, right? The guaranteed additional super, I think, is going to go a lot further than just that extra 59% attack buff being in slot two. Uh, oh, okay. I didn't expect that. All right, goodbye. <laughs> goodbye. Goodbye, Bobby. <laughs> All right, see ya. <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> that was pretty funny. All right, so here we go. This is what we call uh, the big boy turn. Well, can we... I don't... We're not going to get 24 key here. That's the only unfortunate thing. Um... Are we? I don't know. Here, let me do this. I don't think it's going to be 24 key, but it is... It's going to be high. We're, we're going to get close to 20... Oh, it is. It is 24 key. Okay, perfect. All right, so this is 24 key. We have V-Pan's active skill. Goku is stacked up quite a bit. All seven links active. I mean, this is Goku maxed out right here. 320k defense, because, of course, he has stacked his defense quite a bit here as well. So it's not just, like, a mega attack stat he's dropping on this fat boo's head. But he also could quadruple super attack. Wow, 6 million by AGL Gohan right there. Pretty good. Um, yeah, that's that's really good for him. Because they have th those links, right? Like, Legendary Power, Fierce Battle, Saiyan Warrior Race, Super Saiyan, Kamehameha. Like, all those together. That's a lot of attack power that they're giving each other. All right, and Goku is at 12. Okay. <laughs> that's good. I would consider that a really good number. And again, he could bust out three more super attacks right here and he only, he doesn't do any you loser goku oh my god oh we want to see what it done like a 10 million attack stat 12 key super right there ay 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 goku come on bruh all right let's go ahead and pop out goku's active skill right here we are going to be able to sit fat boo down um, I will probably, let's go ahead, we're gonna still run through a lot of, uh, Goku's category teams, right? There's still a lot more category teams he's on that we could take a look at, um, but I will probably do that part without commentary, because, again, it's a lot of teams. Like, at this point, we have a pretty good look at what this Super Saiyan Goku can do, but I'll still show him on all these teams, like, Powerful Comeback, Savior, you know, a lot of different teams like that, so let me know what you guys think. Let's pop this active skill and let's keep it moving. Yeah, 